Who's breathing in my ear like that? What happened to me? Oh my god! What's up, y'all? Your boy Gambino. Welcome back to my channel. Hope everybody's doing great. It's a Sunday for me. You guys probably be seeing this by like Monday or Tuesday or Wednesday. I don't know. I don't plan too far ahead. You guys kind of just get it when I feel it. Anyways, today we're playing Fears to Fathom. I realized that I played the first one and then I played the third one. You guys saw that video, but I've never touched the second one. So yeah, we're going to hop in. It's Fears to Fathom, Norwood Hitchhike. Let's go. June 16th. What we got going on? This happened to me when I was 19. I'm a little over 21 now. Oh, this is kind of low for me. Let me see. Hold on. Okay. I still remember this very clearly because of how creeped out I felt. I was a bit hesitant to write this out for the internet at first. But getting it out may help, even if it's just a little bit. I was one of those people that loves gaming conventions. I go to every convention that I get the chance to. And sometimes even meet some of my online friends. Though my parents weren't always thrilled at the idea of me going on interstate drives, but a plane ticket would have been too expensive. Bro, I feel that these these flights right now, these flights right now are a little outrageous, brother. This convention I was at went great, and it was now the day to drive back home. Oh, how far was the drive? But when I set off, I soon realized the traffic was horrible. I decided that I'd take the long way to avoid the traffic. It was a little over... 12 hour drive tripping by yourself I'll, I'll never make a drive over like six hours by myself bro you never go the back way oh, I get to drive oh yes sir no for real you never hold on. Okay. I can't text and drive oh, I gotta stop Aiden Williams um, it was that's it I'm rerouting here you gotta do what you gotta do on God. Who was my texting? Dad. Drive safe, Holly. Okay. I can get out when I want? Oh, I'm not gonna get out of here. A little, a little creepy. No, you should never, bro. I'm sorry. If you're not familiar with the location or the area or the route, do not take a, a route that is not like... Hey, bro, chill out. Can I turn that off? It's... Driving at night is really therapeutic for me. I understand, bro. I, I really mess with it too. Dad, oh my god, you're really making me text and drive. Where did you reach? Still about six hours away from the city, but stuck in a jam. Bro, I cannot. This is not the best time for me. I can't pop up like, you know, I can't pull my, my hand up like that and do it or something. Literally blocking my whole screen. Oh my god. And then you don't get gas? What am I doing? And halfway through the drive, I realized I was low on gas. If you, bro, you cannot take a route like this if you do not know when the gas stations are, bro. When I take, like, I moved here after college to Austin, Texas, I from West Virginia. It was like a, it was a 21 hour drive. It took me like two and a half days with my girlfriend. And like in states, I'm not home. Told you, I told you to take that flight. Listen, dad, you paying for it? Cause I can't afford that. But yeah, d during that drive, when we were going through states I had no idea about, especially states like Arkansas and stuff like that, they have like a lot of just random back roads or like long interstates. I would get gas at half tank every time to be sure. Hello? Uh-huh, no. Watch, my car gonna break down right here. Is the gas station? Oh, perfect. Damn, I'm whipping this thing. Stop, stop. I close to it so yeah moral of that story is y'all just make sure you have gas when you're traveling don't be that person to have a run button a little okay I don't know why he came on that corner so rough looking all right what's up bud ma'am how can I oh hi can I get 10 on pump 2 you put more than 10 you don't know how Far are you going? You probably have GPS. What, oh, mom? Not now. You're heading to the bridge by yourself? The bridge? Question mark? The Norwood Valley Road, I mean, not 
a lot of people head down there at this time of year. Be careful. Yeah, what do you mean? For about a century now, many people have been going missing down there. And the people who went looking for them never returned. Locals say the Norwood Valley monster had torn them up and hung them upside down in the trees. What do you mean locals? Like, did they see... Were the bodies actually hanging upside down or are you just saying that that's like a myth? Thanks for that. Okay, um, wow. I'm gonna stow stuff? That's so funny. Sorry, what are you doing here? Sorry, I can't see my keyboard. And one more thing. If you see a woman in a white or blue gown trying to get a ride, do not stop. I don't even gotta ask why. Whatever you do, never ever under any circumstances pick up a hitchhiker. Brother, I'm black. I boy. Those people out there in the road putting their thumbs out, they ain't what you think they are, ma'am. They just ain't. Listen, listen. I don't want you guys to think I'm a bad person. That fan was not here when I got here. Who is that? Uh, what did he do? Nah, bro, he was at my car. Nah, he did something to my car. He took something from my car. Did I put gas? You gotta put the gas. How do I put the gas? Um. What? I didn't go to a specific one? Crazy. Anyways. Yeah, I don't want you guys to think I'm a bad person. Hello. But it's just. Oof. Hitchhikers, you just clearly never know their intention, and I don't want to have to even think about it. Like that's a fear, my, like of just I don't know, man. The world is scary, guys. So just make sure you're safe and careful. I filled the tank, and I was off on the road again. I don't know about filled the tank. You put ten dollars in this thing. So since my mom asked, I had to buy something. Oh, what does she want? I don't know if you'll find it a shop in at this hour, but we're out of dog food. Ride a dog food. Can you get something for Milo? I'll pay you back. <sighs> Mom. Right now you need it. Like right now in the moment. You couldn't get it tomorrow morning. I was just in here too. That's crazy. Mm, dog food. Is this it? Oh, this is dog food. That'd be five dollars. Okay. This guy is creepy. Sir, you gonna buy something? Right, let's get the hell out of here, bro. Oh my god, and the biggest things, bro. When people don't lock your door... No one's in here, right? When you go to the gas station, why in the trunk? That thing's gonna fall out. If you're gonna go inside of a gas station, I know even if it's for five seconds, bro, lock your door, for the love of god. Alright. We can put the jams on now. Being on the road, you do realize a thing. Monsters truly do exist. Every single one of them looks like you and me. All I'm saying, I'd have been freestyling right now on the road. Mom, I can't. It's not expiring or anything, right? Dog food expires? You know how long it takes for dog food to expire? What happened to my lights? What happened to your... How did I do that? Ma'am, you need to question why your lights just turned off like that. You're, I think your, your battery about to die. Whatever beat they just had on the radio, I'm about to freestyle. Bro, no. I feel like that guy in that van took my fuse out of my car, bro. Oh my god. And this car going slow as hell. Uh-uh. Sir, you're going a little slow, ain't you? I can't see anything. How does that beep at him? I can't see. I can't see. Where are my lights, bro? That's where they are? Okay, okay. Oof, bro. It's on behind me. What was that? What was that? What was that? Is this is a dirt road? Did I just get to a dirt road? Oh no. 
Oh no. Oh no. Oh, it's just a bridge. Okay. We're good. I mean, this is a little nice and scenic. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, the radio. You lost. In, if you don't got radio signal, dog, you don't have phone signal. That's all that means. Oh, no. Oh, no. Did I just see somebody over there? Oh, is this a dirt road? Where are you going? Stop, bro. I can't see. I can't see. I'm, I'm going to crash this car. She's whipping this thing, though. Let me tell you. I can zoom in. I didn't know that. See anything? See anything? Ah! There was a car stopped there. What was that? What is that? What was that noise? Stop. Not in my ear like that. Th there's just this very weird thing about that night. Oh god. Stop, stop, stop! Man, my brakes ain't that good. Do I have a flashlight? It almost seemed as if. Oh god, I'm sorry. But I didn't think much of it at the time. Sorry guys, I forgot to read the bottom. Those were very heavy. I have to move my car, I guess. Oh, wait. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, what is that? Bro, do I not have a flashlight? I don't. I'm going with this. I'm just vibing at this point. Oh, my God. Hello? Is it not moved all the way? Okay. Won't let me get out. It won't let me drive. Okay. It wouldn't let me drive. I don't know what's going on. Of course the car will start. Oh. The car wouldn't start back up. Oh, of course it wouldn't start back up. Oh. Somebody take and just like that I was standing in the middle of nowhere with no phone service bro you're tripping I'm not saying that I was starting to believe whatever the bull crap that the gas and clerk pulled but I would be lying to say if I didn't feel slightness of unease I mean no you are in the you're in the middle of nowhere man no phone phone service is crazy Oh god, throughout my life I was told not to take rides from strangers. You might have to. Uh, isn't there a guy back this way? But at the moment I had no choice. No, you literally had no choice. I was scared to think how long would it be take for someone to pass. Oh. Ten twenty three PM. Oh, this is worst case scenario. By far the worst case scenario. You can't even. Oh, God. I saw a car nearing. Sir, help me! Damn! Uh, I mean, they. I'm a woman. What am I wearing, bro? I'm a woman. Pure evil. No, that. I didn't understand how somebody would could leave another human being standing like that. Bro, if, if that clerk told somebody else this story about a woman sitting here, you would do the same thing, bro. If I saw a woman sitting out here like this, bro, it's just, I don't know. It's very hard to trust anybody. 1043. 20 minutes. No, I get it. It's like, it's hard to trust people. You can't just be hopping out. Because not everybody has good intentions. I wouldn't just leave them. I would like run out my window and be like, I don't know, man. 
what would you guys do? Would you guys stop and help somebody in the middle of nowhere like this? Or would you just go get help and come back or something? Please help. Please. Please. Damn! Bro, he's gonna take me with him. Oh, he stopped. Oh. Why he stopped so far? Throw my car all the way back there. You didn't have to stop all the way up here. Really go from the gas station. Hi. Thank you so much for stopping. What are you trying to do out here? I, I hunt. I'm trying to hunt, brother. My car clearly broke down. I think my my car broke down. I can't call for help. There's no service. You think I can get a ride? Where are you headed to? Just up the road. Hop in. Thank you so much. Hurry up and just throw it in the bag. I won't be here for too long. My stuff, right? Thank you so much, sir. That's everything, though, right? Okay. I'm done. Finally. <laughs> now hop in and be quick. I don't like how this man acting, bruh. Don't you dare. You ain't got aux or nothing. Yeah, nah. And it's so awkward. See, and this is what I'm saying. So you won't tell me who you are, where you're going? I'd rather not say if that's okay. I live really close from here. I was driving home. I was driving home. And that piece of crap broke down on me. Jason? What? My name's Jason. I'm not, nice to meet you, J Jason. I'm not going to say my name. Keep your hands on wheels, sir. I'm watching you. You're really lucky I had to be on this side of town tonight. No, on God, though. I must say, you are one brave young woman. What, how's that? Y you got any clue what happened to your car back there? I think it was a battery. Are you sure? Because my dad is pretty old. I don't know, man. That guy in that van looked very suspicious. He ran when I got the car. So what do you think about what he told you back at the gas station? Really creep me out. Interesting. Idiot tells that to every person traveling down here. So is it true? What the monster? Let's let's see. I've never seen the monster for myself, but there are there are some things. I'm afraid your car breaking down could have been one of them. What do you mean? Hey, listen. I don't want to sound like a moron, but just remember this. You don't bother them, and they don't. They don't be bothered. And you, I'm sorry. You don't bother them, and you don't be bothered. I respect it. Listen, I, sir, I don't even live here. I was coming through peacefully, and they cut my car down. All right. You know, I'm sorry for being a jerk to you before. I'm not even the be the best with people. I'm not the best with people. You say it's okay. You talking a lot, bro. Turn the radio on, brother. We don't gotta be talking in silence. We're a civilization. How far are we? Damn, this is like an hour and a half from when I... As a little bit of small talk, he dropped me by a motel. Oh, thank God I was a good person, bro. Holy moly. Apparently they offer roadside assistance. Besides, I thought I could use a little rest. Be careful, there's still all kinds of people out there, he said honestly before leaving. A motel offers, I mean, I guess that makes sense because it's a small town like this. That makes sense, easy money. <gasps> Where's your... Oof. Is it not the clerk? That man is playing the creepiest vibe imaginable. Gal, need a room to shack up for the night? How much is it for a room? 40 for a single. That's not bad. Pay cash only. Pay. Room number nine, right over there. Um, ninety ninety dollars. Tommy will take care of it next thing in the morning. Ah, perfect. Good. I'll let Tommy know. And one last thing. 
trying to wake the other guests. They might not take very nicely to it. Alright. Can I grab all my stuff? I'm just gonna go straight to my room. Man, I gotta be all the way over here then. Sorry, Mom. Holly, question mark? It took you two hours? So I still don't have service? How did that go through then? I left all my stuff over there. I'm not sure why. It's nice and warm inside. This is a big-ass TV. For a box TV, open that. Except there's a, sm a smell, a type of musky smell you might get at old houses. Um... Okay. Where's the mattress? Excuse me? What? Where is the mattress? Couldn't have slept there. Bro, wait. Why can't I open this door, bro? Do I need to get my stuff, is the question. Let's try that. You have a great night's sleep. I can't even sleep. There's no mattress, OG. Oh my god! What are you doing here? Motherfucker, what are you doing here? I've been trying to open that door for 20 minutes, bro. He's probably taking a fat shit in my bathroom. Come on now. Shit the crap out of me. Dead ass. He he he. Oh boy. Hell no. Who are you, bro? I'm Tommy. Room service here at the roadway inn. The finest stopover in Norwood. What are you doing in there? You know, cleaning the stuff. The guy at the front desk gave me this room key. He he. Bro, get his ass out of here. I'm just gonna have to ask you to step outside while I make the room. I'll just get my stuff. Oh my god. Alright, now I got all my stuff in the room. Now this man can get out. That's ridiculous. Get your ass out. Get out. How to worry with the Joe about the situation. What is wrong with these people? Mercy, mercy, mercy. But don't worry. It's safe here. I can get your car. And also, there's a. There's, also, room's phone is not working. If need anything just ask the front desk we've been trying to get it fixed but we haven't been seeing enough guests lately but you have a good night okay, get your ass out bro put that dresser in front of the door I can't lock it oh my god okay okay it's all good bro holy moly that man did not need to be sitting there like that what is that What is? Get up! Get up! Get up! Bro, someone is at that window. Get, bro, Holly, get off the bed. Bro, she's not. She's not even acknowledging. Call a foresight, but there was something very off about this place. Ah! Miss my staring through your window. Close the blinds, Holly. Oh my God! You gotta close those blinds. Oh man, the feeling of tiredness was over overcoming my my anxiety. A hot cup of coffee could help, I thought to myself. Okay, I know there's a coffee machine. Ooh. Ooh, that boy is looking through my window. Okay. Now you gotta close your blinds, man. Heck no. I'll get an express or whatever. So many times helps you stay awake. Yeah, just go ahead and give me that. Okay. Okay. Look. Ooh, what happened? What happened? Who's breathing in my ear like that? 
What happened to me? Oh my god. I was drugged. I was drugged. Bro, everything's inverted. Oh, Dad, I'm drunk as hell. I can't even see my... Everything's inverted. Everything's inverted. Everything's inverted. Get inside! I can't see! Oh my god! Lay down, lay down, lay down, lay down. You are not okay. Jesus. It probably wasn't even drawn. It was probably so old. Oh, that, that coffee was probably old as hell. I just got, like, food poisoning. <laughs> bro. It inverted everything. My walking, my looking. Bro, I couldn't see straight. I was sedated. No, for real. You were... You said that phone didn't work. Bro, no way. No way. No way. Pick it up. Please, Ho Holly, t t turn more lights on. No, 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 no. Get up, get up, get up. I saw... The plan was to act like I didn't see him. I know in this game, it's like the choices you make are like you kind of have to. I got set back this far. Oh my god! All right, guys, we'll have to skip forward to where we were. All right, y'all, I got back to where we were. Um, listen, if I saw somebody in my closet, actually, no, I probably would have not looked in it. Also, yeah, okay, that was kind of stupid. Clearly, I can't survive in a scary movie or in real life because I would just be like, somebody in there? You would have sliced my ass up. Easy. I'm easy pickings, so no one try to kill me because you would get me very easy with the most simple things. Oh uh, yeah, I, I saw him. I saw him. Get your ass up. Get your ass up. Get your ass up. Get your ass up. I don't feel safe going out. Go to the bathroom. Go to the bathroom. Go in here. 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 Cl close the door, Holly. Won't let me close the door. I clearly okay. Okay. Is this safe? Is this safe? I'm still very much drunk. Bro, he's moving all up in there. Oh my god, wipe your eyes, Holly. You don't feel safe going out. I just saw that man go into your closet. What do you mean you don't feel safe going out? What are we doing? What is your plan? Are we just gonna go back to sleep? I still can't see my text, bro. Faster than a speeding bullet. Um. Um. Somebody help me. Somebody help me. Hi, sir. Um, didn't I specifically tell you not to wake anyone up? I have complaints. What are you ma making all those goofy sound noises for? Whatever it is, just keep it down, miss. Is that why your eyes are all red? The coffee machine. Are you messing with me? We don't have no coffee machine here. It's right over there. Okay, okay. Here, I haven't had enough of you crazy goons here. For once, I thought we had a sober guest. I guess... I'm crazy over there. Follow me. I hate my job. Lead Joe. Oh. Someone's about to walk out of that, bro. The coffee machine is gone, bro. Bro, he got that... Bruh. It's not here. 
Oh, I'm gonna look crazy. I'm gonna look even more crazy. Hey, 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 I saw that! Bro. Where is it now? It should be over here. It was right here, Joe, I swear. What happened? Show me your coffee machine. I said go back now. There should be some medication in your room that should offer you some relief. Check the table by the TV. Why would you take any medicine left in a, in a motel? Miss Holly, baby, you gotta be careful, dog. Bro, 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 bro. He really, no way. No way, no way. Did he leave? Did he leave? Bro, I don't know about eating random medicine. Yes, he did leave. Oh my god. Bro, you're gonna get pat <laughs> you're gonna get sedated again, Holly. Jesus. My text. Oh Holly, it's gonna be late when you reach back. Hope you're feeling alright. Y'all should be no, she ain't talked to y'all in hours. Be concerned. My mom definitely texted me, no? Did I imagine those texts? Someone's whispering. Oh my god. He does not. Hello. Ooh, uh, he just whispered. Hello. Mm -mm 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 -mm. There's a mic meter. Hello. To respond to open the door who is it please open the door i need help what do you want i need your help please open the door do nothing no fudge that Bro, he's, he's just gonna break in he's just gonna break it i know you're in there please leave i just need to talk to you i swear i'm not a cop Please go away, I'm gonna call the cops. Pre 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 oh my god! Get his ass, Joe! Oh my god. To this day, I find it really weird that the manager in interfered not to
get police. Oh, sorry. The manager inferred not to get police involved as it would have affected Motel's reputation to let go of the situation. I believe that the town could have been home to a coal or drug ring or possibly something even worse. Tommy arrived at, with the car after what felt like a year. I never went on a long road trip again. I would always take airplanes. Yeah, no, you're tripping. There's just certain places you, you can you can't ride you can't drive through certain towns, bro. Hell nah. Wow. Bro, I just love these games because they're based on true stories. And I'm pretty sure the fourth one's coming out soon. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you subscribe and drop a like. You guys have been killing it lately. I really appreciate all of you and love all of you. See you guys for the next one. Peace.